I'm the director of Grenada and the Goat. I first discovered the Goat Dairy two years ago when I went to Grenada to volunteer with them. I started working with them there and doing some filming for them. And I was really inspired, not just by the project and the issues it was trying to resolve, but the people that work at the dairy. Um, the crew there are amazing. They're really passionate about what they're doing and the difference that the project is making, not just to their own lives, but to everyone in their country. Hi, I'm Ruben. I'm helping produce Grenada and the Goat. It's very exciting that we're now uh, sort of nearing production. I suppose I feel very privileged to be a part of this project simply because I feel very passionately about many of the issues that are being raised by the film in terms of you know global food security and particularly that link to inequality. Um, you should care about food security because food is really important. You may not have noticed but everyone needs to eat. The world is only getting more full of people um, and the way that we're making food now, the industrialised food system, is not sustainable so we have to look at the way we're getting food and change that now before it's too late. Um, if the supermarket down your road blew away tomorrow, would you be able to put food on the table for your family? I don't think so, um, because no one knows how to grow their own food anymore. No one knows the connection between where that food comes from and how it gets to the supermarket. Grenada is a good example of an island state that's really dependent on imported food. So uh, almost 50% of the food that they eat there is imported. And that's pretty ridiculous given it's a really lush Caribbean island that has mangoes just falling off trees. It matters that all that food is coming from outside the island because if something happened uh, to those food systems or there's a natural disaster, which is increasingly happening um, because of climate change and has happened before in Grenada, um, then they're entirely dependent on that food that's coming in and, and that would be happening. I think it's a massive issue for the future of these places and these communities. A contribution to our film, whether it's a financial contribution or just sharing links, liking posts, um, I think it really means something because this is a film that is about supporting local food production and community-based projects and this film in itself is supporting local food production and community-based projects. 20% uh, of any money that is donated on the Indiegogo campaign is going straight back to support the dairy. I'm going to Grenada to make the film, but I really want it to be a Grenadian production. So all of the money raised here and the whole production generally is gonna be made by local people in Grenada. We're working with Brainstorm Productions, which is a local uh, film production team. And we're also creating new jobs in Grenada for young people. You know, I think that the values that we're, that we're discussing in the film are, are certainly the way we're going about, uh, about making it as well. Only with your contribution will we be able to make this film and tell the story of the Goat Dairy and the issues that it raises.